say it fell in. Nobody in them, they'll go down. So after months of tracing stories in my lineage, I found out about my oldest living cousin living in Oakland, Mississippi. This is the land where my grandfather and my grandmother was raised. So I traveled through beautiful fields of dandelion flowers and dirt roads and landed on the front lawn of my 91 year old cousin, Mr. James Allen. And here's what he had to say. Okay, so tell me your name again. James Allen. I'm 91. I worked on the heavy with my dad until I got 12 years old. From then on, my dad started renting and I worked with, with, with him. Okay. And so when I got up mad and had family, my children always knew they always worked with, worked with me. Yeah, I think that's for you. Many years speaking. 300, 400 pounds a day. When I was farming, I made cotton and corn. But as I quit then, I started constructing work. Working on the road. I was working on the road about 30 years, 30 years. Then I come to the county, I worked for the county 20 years. That's where I retired from the county, from right here. Looked at that point, and that's where I retired. I mean, I don't been a lot of places, but I don't know where I even did or live. I done a lot of road work. Right in here with the third grade was, you know, third grade clean land that was real good, you know, drag line in the gravel pit. I've been to Hawaii. How was it? Beautiful. No no insects there. You don't see us. No kind of insects in Hawaii. No kind. No flies, no, 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 you don't see us. Out on the beach, you don't see nothing. You don't see nothing. I can go over the gate bridge and all of that. And I got on the other side to go and get rid of the park out there. There's some trees out there big enough to put the tree on. And it's out there, folks, I don't walk through the tree. You ain't never walk through the tree. I did it because it's big enough for a car to drive through. And the tree is on the 300 something. Not that on one tree, but that don't want out in the park. Got a road cut through it. I don't walk through that tree several times when I did the walk. What school is this? Walker High, that's what it's called. Walker High. Walker High. Over school been selling about, about 20 years, close to 20 years, I think, on that. They are uh, integrated. Now, my children, the older children, they went to school here. Yeah. But on the team, the younger, the next one, went to R.N. Nurse, went to school R.N. Nurse. When they integrated, they they changed all the schools to call field. Well, they had proper how to when they first integrated, proper how to black the black boys going to school with the white boys. They had problems. But that was the proper part. It wasn't it wasn't because the black girl was going to school with the white boys. It was because the black boy was going. That's the problem. That's all the problem been in, in Mississippi and well, all over the United States. Right. Black men problem been the problem. It ain't been the it ain't been the black women's problem. But the white man wanted both sides. He wanted the black women and the white ones too. But he didn't want you to have his white women. Well BB King used to sing a song, Nobody Love My Book, my mother, and she could be jiving too. She could be jiving too. <laughs> yeah. That's right. You look so, you look so spiffy and handsome. Look at you. Don't look like no 91. And you 91? Hello, how, how are you doing? doing? Good to see you again. Yeah. 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 I really yeah. like this outfit. Yeah, yeah. I like your outfit. Do you like what's in the outfit? Woo! <laughs> <laughs>